Hey guys, welcome to Excel Tutorial channel again and another episode of statistical function and formulas in Excel. So in this video, we are going to cover mode function in Excel, which returns the most frequently occurring number in a list of numbers. So if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do it because we are going to cover each and every functionality of Excel in upcoming days, months, every year. So let's get started. So here we have a very basic sheet, which is the date, sales and the store code here. And we need to find uh, most frequently sales number which also a multi which you're gonna learn in upcoming minutes so what does mode means mode function in excel helps to find the frequently occurring number in a list of numbers okay if you want to find the frequently occurring sales number or roll number or marks in your worksheet then use mode functions there are three type of mode function mainly it's simple mode function and mode plus single simple and mode dot single works the same way there's no not much difference in between the two because i didn't find any difference in my daily work life so there's also one more mode function which is mode mode multi which helps to find multiple occurring value in a list of number without any chit chat let's get started so we need to sort this table here first is most frequent sales number so let's just find the most occurring sales number in our range we just need to enter our simple mode function first here you get the simple arguments which is number one number two so we just need to select the range here and close the parenthesis so there you go so there 14 is the most occurring number in our range here as compared to the other so mode and mode dot single works exactly the same there is no difference which i find if you have found something the difference between the two you can just leave the comment and let us know because you can also teach us something new we are very open to it so in the next part we have a multi okay if you want to find frequently occurring numbers or you can say multiple frequently occurring number as we can see there are many repetitive number 14 we have 12 we have 11 also yeah and we have a 10 also so let's see if we can find a multiple occurring number in our worksheet so we just need to enter mode dot mult this is the abbreviation of multi here just select the range like that and click enter so it will revert back us 14 and 12 which is the most occurring number in our worksheet so hope you understand how this mode function works and there's a limitation to this mode function as it only works with number it doesn't work with text strings or any other strings so if you want to work with the text string like here we have a a b b and a store code here if you want to find the most occurring store code in our worksheet that you can do that but with the help of helper function like index and match okay so if you haven't watched that index and match functions video covering each and every scenario you can, may face in your daily excel live so you must watch that video because that will be very helpful so index and match is very very important formula so in this particular scenario we need to find the most occurring store code here it may, can be a or it can be b and we will use the mode function don't worry about it we are not getting carried away from our topic of this video which is mode so let's just input the index here open up the index function so here in the reference we need to add this particular reference we don't need to touch anything else we just want to find the most occurring stored code here comma and in the next is row number and the for the row number we need to enter the mode here to find the most repetitive row number so and for that we for the numbers part we need to enter here a match okay let's match the lookup value will be the same and lookup array will be the same and the exact match will be the zero and close the parenthesis once again and again and let's see if we can find so we have found a is the most occurring number in our selected range so let's find out we have one two three four five six seven eight so we have eight number of a's here so let's find out how many b's are there one two three four five six seven so yes so eight obviously greater than seven so hope you understand how you can also find the most occurring 
text string in worksheet using the combo of index and match and our favorite mod function so if you have learned something from this video please click the like button if you have some question in mind relating to this particular part then you have a comment box with you and if you want to subscribe to this channel please do it because you are going to miss a lot of things in coming future and if you want to share this video to your friends colleague or social media handle then use the share button so see you in the next video until then bye bye